my video journal and thoughts from Mesa, Modesto, uh, and into LA. Fantastic, fantastic, very busy seven or eight days of my life. So I landed in San Francisco and Dr. Alex came to pick me up. This guy is really the reason why I got to come out on this adventure and what a healer, what a professional at what he does. I could tell right away that this guy is very good at his job. Made a significant difference on my old broken body. Uh, really fixed me up. Thank you for all the opportunity, Alex. We dropped in a first tactical. That's my new buddy, Corey. He hooked me up with all sorts of cool swag. See what I'm talking about? First tactical. Bam. Look at this, look at this bag. Look at this bag. New bag. Oh, I'm in heaven. Vagrant uh, level up. Homeless guy. Power up. So we had a couple days. Ate like uh, like kings. Man, I, uh, I think I'm going to lose weight when I go on these trips, but I always just get more and more huge thanks to days like this. The seminar was so incredible. I got to pull all sorts of people that I hadn't pulled before, strong people, um, and, and I got to, yeah, well, this this is Mr. Armtube. We had some fascinating uh, discussions about the relevancy of the strap and uh, about how having a long arm can just open up your top roll lane. Great arm wrestlers all through the house. Got to see my good old buddy, Tom Nelson. You guys know. You guys know about can't beat him, choke him. You guys know where that comes from. You know that uh, that shirt, choke in the middle? That's Tom. But it wasn't long, and I was on the road again, getting ready to fly to Mesa. What's up, everybody? Here I am, hanging out in the ditch. I have officially made it to one of the towers of arm wrestling, Mesa, um, Arizona. I'm just probably a kilometer or so from the great John Brzezank's house. And yeah, this is like a pilgrimage for me. Uh, I haven't ever come to John's house. Way overdue. I remember when I was 18 in the sport, I'm like, I got to just go and I just got to live close to him. I just got to go move close to him and just train under him. And and I never did. Got a job and all sorts of other responsible things, but I always wished that I could have just gone and trained under him. So I'm 30 years late. See you in a bit, John. Hey, what an incredible day here. Hey. Oh, oh John. Wow. What's another win? Hello, Renee. Hello. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hello. In paradise right now. Yeah. This is the end of the uh, end of the documentary. A lot of this footage will not come out. You'll have to see it on the dock. Love everybody. So that's it. Not a lot of arm wrestling stuff to show you from Mesa, but you are going to see it thanks to this dude right here, my dear young friend, Rory McIntosh Turner. This is uh, the guy who's in charge of the documentary that we've been working on for a year. We're finished. We did it. It's it's a wrap. And now comes the process of editing. This is us driving from Mesa into L.A. Uh, yeah, it's uh, bittersweet. It's been great hanging out with this this guy. I, I think he has a super bright future, and I'm and I'm glad that I got to be part of one of his early projects. Pit stop, and we stopped at Derek Smith's place on the way. Hey, look who I see. Holy, look at the size of this guy. Oh, nice to meet you, Bridget. Nice to meet you. I think you're going to wonder it. I mean, this thing could kill me. Oh, hey, hey, big guy. 
What's up, everybody? Big day today. Uh, my big buddy, Derek Smith, is probably just a couple minutes from picking me up. I'm gonna, we're probably going to have a good scrap today. He's looking huge and strong. Really looking forward to training with him today. Just a couple minutes, and then after that, we'll probably eat some food and head into L.A., and double header today. So practice out here at Derek's and then we'll be at Mendy's gym tonight. So hopefully see some of you guys. Oh, there he is. There he is. You see that guy? It's Derek. Oh no. Made it to Yakoipa. Yakaipa. Yakaipa. Uh Yeah, Derek Smith's place. So, so the best way we can do it is we just fight at a high level when we get together every time, no matter what. So here he is. Hey, buddy. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes. Hey, I was just talking about you. Hey, what's up? Is that right? Is that really real? <laughs> it is real, isn't it? Man, you are. How big are you, Derek? Um, six eight. I think I'm really six eight. I mean, so I was a little taller than Brian. He was mad about it, but uh. I, uh, I think I'm 60, like 345. Man. Yeah, you know, I'm a grown boy. Hey, how's it gonna go today? Oh, good, Ned. How is it gonna go today? Oh, hey, boys. Hey, boys. Hey, how's it gonna go today? Um, I don't know, man. I, you know, huh? let's just see what you got. I mean, what's, what's up here? Oh, I've been working, eh? I just like, got a I've, lot of body fat, you know? <laughs> yeah, you're a big dude. Are you like Alex Predecha, babe? Um, I'm taller than Alex. You are? I'm taller than Alex. Yeah. So, a hey, nice shirt, nice shirt. Yeah. Okay. What are we doing today, buddy? Gonna, you and we're, me. We're gonna, we're gonna like, rip a little bit. Full at it, right? Okay. Listen, yeah. it's important. And you get to pick. You get to pick. Pick what? Format. Yeah. Oh, your all hook. Oh no no no. I, no no listen. <laughs> I'm talking about rules of the match. Oh, all hook. Oh my pick? god. All shoulder commitment. Oh, inside arm wrestling. Oh, oh god, my god. Shit. Really? <laughs> you really want that? Ooh. It's been a while since you went that shoulder forward. Buddy, I. Well, it's, okay, all right. Okay. So, what are we doing? A three out of five? Oh, we're, you want to do a match? Yes, buddy. Of oh, course. Jesus. I didn't know about all this. Well, what else? What did you do the last time? We had a day notice. Yeah. We had a Superman. Buddy. Oh, I, you sandbagging. I, pull, I pulled John Brzezink yesterday. Oh, where's the footage? Exactly. Exactly. Ah. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Oh, man. You want to have a match? Deal, I want to. Dealer's choice, buddy. Dealer's I choice. I love you. Table. I love you. Let's Whatever just, your choice. Let's just, just, all right, let's do it. All right. Okay. Hey, can you do me? Can someone do me a favor? Mike, what's up, stud? Hey. Oh, buddy, I'm so happy to see you again. So hey, you've been you, killing it. I'm um, recording right now, everybody. Former tennis star, turned arm wrestler, dominating. We gonna pull? With, are you pulling tonight at Mendy's too? Yeah. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Guys, you want to watch that match? Go to Derek's channel, AW Derek. Watch, uh, well, it wasn't really a match. It's kind of us messing around. Check it out there. All right, guys. We just had, I, I would say, an awesome practice <laughs> for me. But uh, I think I left the club a little bit hungry still. Yeah. For years, this guy's been saying he can eat more sushi than me. I'm, I'm trying to figure it out. I'm not oh, even hungry, but... Are we doing that tonight? Are we doing that right now? Oh, we, I mean, if you want to. Oh, my God. Oh, hey, everybody. Hey. Okay. He's making me walk. <laughs> it's healthy to walk, guys. <laughs> I'm trying. It's healthy to walk. <laughs> so, I apologize. Uh, we're going to be a little bit late because I'm old and I'm out of shape. And if I don't walk sometimes, I'm going to break my back. So... We're eating fudge like bees <laughs> and loading up and we'll be at practice probably in half an hour or so. Hey, thanks, uh, Aloha and Whisper. These things are delicious. And when I do these trips, I love it because I get to arm wrestle so many people and the energy is incredible guys come at me hard guys i haven't seen in a long time we test each other i get so much table time and the cosmic punch theory is real guys this here is actually my second workout of the day uh 
so I, I got done with Derek in the morning, and we came in, and this is our nighttime workout. Um, yeah, so arm wrestle pretty much every day as usual on this trip. Um, lots of clubs, and groups across LA, and uh, yeah, and then there was John and uh, all the guys up in Modesto beforehand. Mendelssohn's gym is like a mecca for strength. Everybody knows Scott Mendelssohn, world record bench press holder, who is still dabbling in the world of arm wrestling. And Vresh is, <laughs> Vresh is the toughest dude, seriously. If you guys don't know who Vresh is, well, there's lots of videos of him and I arm wrestling. He's a world champ at 165, 165 pounds. And I think he might be one of the top ranked guys in North America at left hand. I don't know what that says about him or what that says about North America. But uh, anyway, you cut it. Vresh is the real deal, guys. Vresh is a one amazing little athlete. And I don't even like to call him little. He's just one amazing athlete. Um, I always look forward to getting on the table with him every time I come through L.A. And this time was no different. Um, yeah, if anybody's in this area, L.A., I mean, L.A.'s a great big place, but this gym could be filled with arm wrestlers, all you guys. Get get to Mendy's gym, start training with these guys, find Derek, find Dr. Alex up in Modesto. Um, <laughs> I don't know how much you want to bug John, but if you're anywhere in Arizona, well, obviously, John Brzezink is... Uh, that's that's the mecca of arm wrestling. And to everybody who thinks that you can't do arm wrestling practice um, every day or uh, you know every other day, I'll tell you it's just it's just not true. You have to change the way you arm wrestle. You have to arm wrestle safely. Don't don't hurt yourself in practice. If it doesn't feel right, let it go. Pull safely with your partners. Huh? Oh, in the strength mecca in LA. Yeah. What's up, Mandy? What up, baby boy? Hey, what a, what a great night. What a great night. LA squad. Get in front. LA squad. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you feeling, big buddy? Uh, fresh. How you feeling? Yeah, fresh. Yeah. Fresh like fresh. Yeah. yeah. Like... <laughs> uh, I'm a gamer. I'm a video gamer. Yeah. My whole life. And uh, I, I'm a professional shoutcaster for League of Legends. Hey, great night here tonight. <laughs> Little party. Hey, check this out. This is persimmon tree right in your backyard. <laughs> hey, that's, I wish we had this in Canada. So last night in LA was a more chill night, got my ass kicked in the chest a whole bunch. Uh, and I did I did a bunch of arm wrestling. Um, one of my more relaxed practices here I'm with Micah. I, this guy has not been arm wrestling that long. Uh, really, really got very, very good very quickly. So I was happy I got to pull with him a couple times during during this trip. He's got a uh, really bright future. Yeah. Yeah. Watch out for him. Hey, so it's been an awesome trip. Uh, and my flight leaves in like 12 hours. And there's a whole bunch of things I wanted to do today, but I decided that uh, I'll just walk to the airport. Uh, that's like, uh, I think it's 46 kilometers from here. <laughs> that's probably not going to do it. I got uh, double backpacks, the one I came with, and the one from First Tactical. Thank you, guys. Carrying all my stuff, and uh, yeah. Great way to finish up this trip. I'll run up in there if somebody's in there. Eight. And then you go oh, more to this, and then you go one, two, 